Now Bannerman's back in there. Keep an eye on Ryan. He's flanked out to the left. Talented freshman from Foxborough. Lowry looks to the right, looking for Mahoney. Back shoulder. Perfect. He's got Perfect. it. Perfect. Touchdown, Falcons. Drew Mahoney pulls it in from seven yards away. His third receiving touchdown of the season. Bentley strikes first. They lead 6-0. Extra point attempt coming up. Cavallis, hand off to Pierre. He's got the first down and then some Malik Pierre. Inside the Bentley oh. 40. Ball came out. Ball's free. And Who's I got it? Bentley's. Pierre lost it fighting for extra yards. Uh, Bentley and thinks they is. have it. No indication yet aside from Blue Jersey's point in their direction. And they do. So far, really limited. There's a handoff jet sweep, flag down on the near sideline. Good gain there. Ball out by Kamani Bentley Aldrich, ball. and he lost the ball. Oh my goodness, he lost the ball. Bentley's got it. Kamani Aldrich, he's saying he's down. The official's talking it over, and they're saying it's Bentley football. Nick Athey on the recovery on that. We're going to have to check the flag. Remember, there's a flag down. Team in the country, 3-0 LIU post. Lowry to throw. Near sideline, bubble screen to Mahoney. Mahoney makes a man miss, score. 15, 10, he's gonna score. Touchdown Falcons. Second of the day for Mahoney. They lead 12, nothing, and what a start today for Bentley. Ball at the LA Post 22 yard line. Fake the handoff, Lowry, good pocket to the end zone. Ryan's oh. got it, oh, what a catch. Touchdown Bentley. What a pitch and catch right there. Lowry's third first half touch and toss. This one to the freshman Austin Ryan. Bentley leads 18 to nothing. And Lowry could have stood there for a half an hour. There was absolutely no pressure at all on him. Was able to stand back, survey the field, made a pass where only Ryan could catch it. There was no chance of anybody else touching that. Fantastic play by Bentley. That was a spectacular throw by Lowry and a great catch in the end zone by Ryan. His third receiving touchdown of the year. Just to the left, interesting formation. Lowry pumps, looking deep, looking deep down the field for Ryan to the end zone. Oh, what a my! Catch. Austin Ryan brings it in. What, what a, a catch! catch. Oh. And Bentley leads 25 to seven. Lowry's fourth passing touchdown of the first half. What a catch by the freshman Ryan, his second of the day. I'll tell you what, I want to check those gloves he's got on because they got to have suction cups on him. What a phenomenal catch. 29 yards on the pitch and catch, and that was as wonderfully executed as you will see. Yeah, plays out of Gavalis looking to the left, comes back over the middle. The ball is deflected in and the air, accepted. and it's picked off. Another interception in the end zone. They did it three times last week, and they do it here. Gavalis picked off first and 10. Bentley. And that's Nick Athey on the interception on the tip ball. You make your own breaks. That was a big one. Talked about needing a takeaway. That is a okay. huge play right there. By the junior. What a play there. Third Bentley takeaway of the afternoon. And I got to say, that's on Cavallis for trying to fit that ball yes. in there. He's got to know better than that as well. Absolutely. First and 10 for the Falcons. They get the takeaway they needed. And that brings life back to this house. Aaron Waltham. Cavallis gets it off. Pressure comes. Screen throw to Williams. This play has a chance. Williams ball. lost the ball. Ball's on the ground. Eighth is in the area. Did Bentley generate another turnover? Yes, they did. They did. Yes, they did. Fourth takeaway of the game by this Bentley defense. That's now nine in two weeks. And that's how the third quarter comes to a close. Williams has it taken away. It'll be first and 10 Falcons when the fourth quarter and gets Athey underway. Again. Wow. Nick Athey all over the field. He's got to get this back to a two-score game at this point. Mahoney in motion. Lowry rolling to his right. Looking deep down the field, looking for Ryan. He's, he's got, got a step, he's got and him. he's got it. Austin Ryan will take it the distance. 56 yards, the fifth of the day for Lowry. Third for Ryan. Bentley leads 32 to 21. What a great pass by Lowry. Talk about hitting a guy in stride 50 yards away. That was unbelievable. This young man is special. Oh, Austin is. Ryan, the development of a superstar, his third of the day. This one from 56 yards away. And what a beautifully diagrammed play. Misdirection and then streaking down the near sideline is the freshman from Foxborough to reel it in. 
And as Roger mentioned, you cannot throw that football any better. Yeah. And they hope their defense can win on the game. This time, as you said, 26 wasn't going to be enough. They knew it, and they went up top. Over the middle, Mike Williams makes the catch. Ball comes Ball out. out. It's recovered by Bentley. The fifth takeaway of the game. <laughs> Bentley takes it away. Sullivan, for the second time, puts it on the turf. And this time, Andrew Carmichael, the junior, emerges with it. That might just do it here for the Falcons. And all of a sudden, you're going to think this Bentley team, team that was picked to finish in the middle of the pack by the coaches, has a chance as Brzezinski takes it inside the 10 to the 5, lunges. No sign yet. Oh, there there it is. Touchdown. touchdown, Bentley. I don't understand exactly what the delay was on that unless they were trying to think his knee might have been down before the ball crossed. But what a run. This kid's going to be a good player. Andrew Brzezinski takes it in. And the party is on here at Bentley. It's now 39 to 21. Falcons on top. Scored today by the Falcons. Andrew Brzezicki with his third rushing touchdown of the year. Partner is basically so I don't know who picks the Northeast 10 player of the week, <laughs> but the defensive player of the week has to be a pretty good candidate, Nick Alley. <laughs> Quentin McDermott won it last week with a pair of interceptions and a forced fumble in the win at Merrimack. You good? Bentley wins by a final score Great of 40 to 21. Roger, what a win by this team. Great win. As you said, the signature win they've been looking for, they have it now. Now the challenge is keep it going.